Okay, so in this uh, video, we're gonna de derive simple exponential and ln functions and also uh, log functions as well. So pretty much similar rules, but slightly different. Let's start with the uh, e function. So if you have e to the power of x and you're ever deriving just e to the power of x, it's always the exact same thing. So the derivation of three e to the x is the exact same thing. Now the derivation of ln x is 1 over x. So if I derive this over here, the 4 stays on the top. The ln x turns into 1 over x. So the bottom is just going to be x. So that's 4 over x. If I'm deriving 6 to the power of x, you start by writing the exact same thing, 6 to the power of x. But then you multiply that by ln of the base. So 6 to the power of x, ln 6. And for a log function, it's similar to a ln function. The only difference is that uh, the base comes into account here. So the derivation of 3 log 2x is 3 over x. So just like ln log is over x, but you also have to multiply the top by ln of the base. So it's 3 ln 2 over x. Let's try with this other example over here. Derivation of e to the x, it's just the exact same thing. So e to the x. The derivation of 5 ln x is just 5 over x. Derivation of 3 to the power of x, you write the same thing and then you multiply by ln of the base. The derivation of log x, well, that's going to be over x for sure because whatever's here moves down to the bottom. But you have to put the base, ln of the base up here. And the base, if it doesn't show any base here, it means that the base is 10. So I have ln 10 over x. And then finally, e to the power of 5. e to the power of 5 is a trick question. There's no x there. That's just a constant. And when you derive constants, that just disappears. So this is your final solution.